Well, since yesterday afternoon, we've had two small children drown in local pools. One was a three-year-old at this community pool in Northeast Harris County. The other, last night, was a one-year-old who drowned in a home swimming pool. Now, this is a tragedy that impacts too many families in our area every year. And now one group is taking extra steps to make sure children know how to survive in the water. KPRC Local 2 reporter Lisa Baldwin is live in Seabrook, Harris County. And Lisa, the classes there aren't really your typical swim lessons. Not at all. This program is developed by a behavioral psychologist. Says he did it because he wanted to save kids' lives. Now, right now, we're in the Samore family's backyard. They say it's heart-wrenching to them to hear how so many local children have drowned. This is where they're giving their little girl, Leah, lessons. Little Leah is only 12 months old, but in just a few weeks, Leah learned to float on her back by herself. Amazing. It, just amazing. Um, in four weeks, she could completely roll onto her back and float without any assistance. And I, I just want that peace of mind that she has the skills needed um, should she ever fall in the water. Leah is one of thousands of Texas children who've taken lessons through a unique program called Infant Swimming Resource. The focus is self-rescue. Certified instructors use touch to teach infants to roll on their backs and float. Toddlers and older kids are taught to get to a wall and how to rest along the way in case they're tired. The instruction is one-on-one -on -one and tailored to each child. Every single day, the mass practice of the skills, that's going to where your retention comes in. And we have short lessons to make sure that they're not fatigued and their muscles aren't overtired. Owen McCauley is only 17 months old. His mom says after five days of instruction, Owen could float on his own. Valerie McCauley says she first got interested after seeing these videos on the Infant Swimming's website showing young toddlers safely making their way through the water. I'm amazed because I thought it was too good to be true. Like I was trying it out thinking, there's no way that's real. And now? It's, it's absolutely real. It's amazing. Since so many accidents involve kids falling into the water, the training includes teaching them to float with clothes and shoes on. It's just a big peace of mind knowing that, like Tammy said, even the most diligent parent, one or two seconds in, they're out of your sight. Everyone involved stresses that this technique is not a replacement for parents having eyes on their kids. It's just an extra layer of protection. And because of the one-on-one -on -one time, this program for four weeks could cost about $500. Reporting live in Seabrook in Harris County, I'm Lisa Baldwin, KPRC Local 2.